Blood clots that form in veins deep in the body can be life-threatening. These clots have the potential to break free, traveling through the body's bloodstream and blocking arteries in the lungs. The consequences of these clots can be life-threatening. While these blood clots can strike anyone, hospitalized patients are particularly at risk because of the illnesses they face and the decrease in mobility or normal activity that often accompanies their acute change in health status. In our commitment to patient safety and quality care, your healthcare team at Christiana Care Health System in Delaware partners with patients to determine their individual risk, apply evidence-based prevention strategies, and monitor patients for early signs and symptoms of deep vein thrombosis, since nearly all hospitalized patients are at risk. The incidence of deep vein thrombosis, it's a much larger number than folks might realize. About 600,000 people per year develop a deep vein thrombosis here in the United States, and about 100,000 of them develop serious complications from those clots. Deep vein thrombosis, very simply, is a clot that occurs in one of the deep or large veins within the body. Generally, that's in the legs or the pelvis. When that clot breaks off, moves through the heart, it can go to the lung. That's called a pulmonary embolism. The pulmonary embolism is immediately life-threatening and can have a 30 to 60% mortality. Venous thromboembolism is a much general term that we use to encompass all of these, the deep vein clots, the clots to the lung. And so venous thrombosis and venous thromboembolism all are used fairly synonymously when we talk about clots in the body. Hospitalization can increase the risks for this potentially deadly condition nearly tenfold. Our role as a respectful, expert, caring partnership with our patients is to let them know that they are indeed at risk for developing clots in their legs, and that our role is to try to work with them to prevent those clots from forming. That's why patients at Christiana Care undergo a comprehensive risk assessment by their doctor when they enter either Christiana Hospital or Wilmington Hospital to help prevent them from experiencing a serious blood clot. When we assess the risk of, of our patients for the deep vein thrombosis, we leverage our electronic health record systems so we are able to initiate a comprehensive review. We use our innovative systems of care to assess the risk for each patient when they arrive and again when they transition from one unit to the next. We routinely refine our assessments to keep our patients safe from these dangerous clots. While the risk of blood clots are more well known in surgical patients, Patients admitted for non-surgical conditions also face an increased risk of deep vein thrombosis. After the risk has been assessed, patient care teams at Christiana Hospital and Wilmington Hospital start a multi-pronged action plan to help prevent their patients from experiencing a blood clot. That action plan includes multidisciplinary rounds that help Christiana Care's patient care teams recognize the changing risk for each patient, Pharmacy monitoring, including the prescription of medicines that prevent blood clots, is given in partnership with consultation with the patient care team. As caring partners in our neighbor's health, we at Christiana Care strive to educate patients on these medicines. These medicines are given through an injection. Patients are not moving as much as they would at home, so they are still at risk for developing a blood clot while they're in the hospital. Pharmacists partner with other providers on multidisciplinary rounds to ensure that these patients are getting the right medicines to prevent blood clots from forming. Nurses on each patient care unit partner with patients to help them understand their risk for deep vein thrombosis and the actions they can take to prevent it. On a daily basis, Christiana Care's nurses help hospitalize patients maintain and resume their level of activity and ensure that they can safely move within their room and unit as their condition permits. At Christiana Care, we have a preoperative team which calls all patients who are having elective surgery or scheduled surgery, and they do a detailed history, um, get a background on some of the medications and the risks, and they also do some education. There are a lot of educational videos and things that are available on our Get Well network, so patients are, are informed and educated, and we also ask them questions before they even get here about their risk for blood clots. Our nurses work very closely with the physicians and the providers. When patients are admitted, a detailed exchange or a huddle takes place between that provider and the nurse and they learn all about what they need to do to prevent blood clots for their patients. Physical therapists also partner with patients who may benefit from physical activity that prevent blood clots from forming. As part of our promise to patient and family-centered care, when we first enter the patient's room, we explain to them why they're at risk for blood clots and what we can do to help. 
We have special exercises to help increase the blood flow throughout the patient's lower extremities. We teach the patient how to perform ankle pump exercises in bed so that they can maintain good blood circulation. Given that many of the serious blood clots develop in the legs, we have special exercises where patients squeeze and relax their thigh and buttock muscles to improve circulation. Patients who are at risk for blood clots often face serious health problems and may not have the strength to go for walks on their own. However, Christiana Care's physical therapists encourage their patients to take part in simple actions that can increase their blood flow and reduce their risk of developing clots. If the patients have a heightened risk of falls, we start with simple goals such as getting out of bed. As the patient improves, we're able to start progressing their goals and having the patient transfer out of bed to a chair and eventually walking down the hallway of the patient care units. These actions help to strengthen the patient and decrease the risk of blood clots. Patients who can't exercise as they recover from their condition are fitted with special boots that simulate the effects of physical exercise, thereby preventing the formation of clots. Christiana Care's innovative and coordinated initiatives are put in place from the time patients arrive and throughout the length of their stay. We are committed to helping our patients at discharge by providing them all of the information that they need to go home safely. As part of the discharge process, we teach and we advise our patients on any treatment they need to continue at home, along with any activities they can do after discharge that will keep them healthy and reduce the risk of deep vein thrombosis. We've taken many steps that follow the patient from the outpatient before they've been admitted to the hospital, through their inpatient stay, and then on to the discharge process where we've tried to partner with patients to have a strategy that's going to prevent clots from forming.